family, brothers and sisters, the whole truth and nothing but the truth. I'm about to tell you something that's gonna shake, it's gonna rattle your minds. It's something I've known for a long time, but has now <laughs> inspired me and it's been brought to my attention again. And I've known this for a long time, okay? Now what I'm about to share with you, well, it's gonna freak you out probably, more than likely, but this is not a prediction, this is a statement. What I'm telling you is the truth. So, it all started like this. When I was in, <laughs> when I was in Northern California, well, Southern California, I saw something really really interesting in the sky i don't want to go into what it looked like because it was fucking weird but then i moved to northern california right yes i did in northern california my brothers and sisters i saw every night i saw ufos in the sky okay i saw ufos in the sky every night it was not a night went by that i saw testing from travis air force base testing UFOs, okay? This is true. And what I'm about to tell you, don't get too freaked out about. I've known it for a long time. Now, for all you Bible thumpers out there, happy Easter. <laughs> I didn't say that. I did say that. So, um, there is Independence Day, right? Okay, let me let me go back a little bit. There was a president that once said, if all of a sudden aliens came down from the sky, we would unite, <coughs> we would unite together as one country. It'd be like the new world order. Well, I'm here to tell you what's coming in our future. Now, crop circles, how are they made? Crop circles, how are they made? Well... If you haven't acknowledged and if you're not interested, well, whatever. But I'm going to tell you how they're made. They show how they're made all over the internet, right? Cow mutilations. Why are they doing this? It is the same thing as predictive programming, okay? Now, if you watch movies or if you like Rick and Morty, which I love Rick and Morty, I'm here to inspire you and tell you the truth because the truth is all now coming to light. Rick and Morty. There's an episode in Rick and Morty where a bunch of heads come down from the sky and they're like, play a tune for us. And they're like, whoever doesn't play the tune, we're going to blow up this earth or whatever. I don't remember. It's not the point though. So in Rick and Morty, everybody started bowing down to these beings in the sky and they were just big heads. Okay, they were just big heads. Well, I'm here to tell you something that is going to probably freak you out. What is to come? Now, there is 2.7, I believe, billion or trillion dollars <clears throat> missing from the government. Now, why would all this money go missing from the government? Well, I'm about to tell you something that I've seen. I know how weather is manipulated. I know how it can be manipulated. I've seen it. I've seen big ass rainbows follow me around. And when I say big rainbows, I mean rainbows that, I, I, it's almost hard to explain, but they were so large that I could tell they were fake. The other day in this clouds, I saw <laughs> a cloud disperse, literally. When I say disperse, it's spread apart from a heart. <laughs> Yes, this is true. I'm not lying about this. From a heart to uh, a boar's head into the laughing cow that you see on the laughing cow cheese. True story. I swear on everything I love on this, okay? this I swear on everything I love. Prior to that cloud, I saw another cloud dispersed into a big heart, okay? What is to come? Okay, you see it in a lot of movies. It's Orwellian. I and mean, we're living in an Orwellian timeline right now. It, we don't even know what year we're in. Some say 2012, some say 2020. I believe we're in 2012. Okay, plain and simple. Yes, you're probably in 2012. 
We don't even know what timeline we're in. We don't even know the year, yo. So, what's coming from the sky? And this is going to happen in our lifetime. As the president said, if we would all unite if aliens came down from the sky. sky, <laughs> Okay? You are going to see in your future, they already have um, a way of manipulating the matrix. I've seen it. I see it in the clouds every day, every day. Just I can see things that you can't. I don't know. Maybe you all aren't paying attention. But this is what's to come. There are going to be aliens that are going to be coming down. Or not aliens. It's going to look like spaceships in the sky. This is what's to come. I'm not lying to you. So remember, after you see this video, don't get scared when it happens because it's coming. And this is some valuable information. And yes, I am inspired right now. Thank you. I feel much better. So... I just had to be born on Easter Sunday, right? I said it. I said it. <laughs> okay. You are going to soon see... You are going to soon see alien spaceships, what look like alien spaceships in the sky. Okay? This is a true story. This is valuable information. Don't take it for granted. Because what I'm telling you now, it's going to scare some people when it comes. They're going to question everything from religion to sanity to what they thought they knew, it's gonna scare the living shit out of people. And this is the reason why I am giving you the warning ahead of time. So I highly recommend you listen to my info. I have the intel here, okay? I've been handed down the knowledge to hand back to you. But I've already known this. There are gonna be alien spaceships, what look like alien spaceships, but they're nothing more than holograms. That's what I saw in the sky in <clears throat> California. Or, er, yeah, it wasn't just, yeah, it was California, but I also crossing the country, I saw the biggest rainbows. I, I don't even know. It leaves me speechless thinking about it. I saw such large rainbows that this shit freaked me out. I'm like, there's no way that's real. There's no way it's real. There's, I just kept telling myself, there's no way that's real, dude. <laughs> so, they have the technology to do this. They are going to pull a stunt on the whole world. It's not going to be just the United States. It's going to be the whole world. And the stunt is going to be a fake alien invasion. They've been doing cow mutilation for years, okay? They've been doing this to prep you for it. It's the same concept as predictive programming. We already believe there's aliens. Yes, there may be, but they're, they're on a different plane right now. Now our government is hiding things from you that I'm here to bring to light. Now, with that said, what are you going to see in your future? I just told you. When you're going to look back at this video after it happens, you're going to be like, wow, how did he know this? Well, I was, I have the intel. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, universe. I have the intel, but I've already known it. But the universe just gave me back my power because I forgot about all this. So, Again, what's to come? You are going to see alien spaceships in the sky, but they're not going to be real. They're going to be in a holographic form, and it's going to scare the living shit out of people. So prepare mentally and physically for what's to come. I'm not playing. This ain't no joke. This is it. We are living in or the Orwellian times. Like, have you ever seen... Uh, a great fantastic movie um, war of the worlds that's what it's like the only difference is there's not they're not real they're just false images in the sky so <laughs> I'm handing down this information and I'm saying it with a stern voice right now because whoever receives this you are I'm giving you a gift right now I'm gifting you with this knowledge do not take this knowledge for granted spread the truth you're, you're about to see some things in your lifetime that you would never have thought was real. I've already seen it. I've already seen it. In my, it, it all it took was for me to take the, cross the country, and I saw it. Rainbows following me around. I have videos of it. If you go back in my videos, you can see them. Yeah, you can. And we're not talking small rainbows. We're saying, I'm talking giant freaking rainbows that didn't go away. So... <laughs> Be inspired, my children, but understand what's to come. I'm saying it with a stern voice. This is my serious face right now. 
This shit is serious, dude, and it's gonna scare the living, it's gonna cause chaos on Earth. And you, a lot of people are gonna freak out, but if you get this message, you're not gonna, you're gonna already know what time it is. If you don't know what time it is, well, now you do. And I don't even need to wear a watch because I know intuitively what was gonna happen. I've been known this. I predicted the coronavirus. I predicted all this stuff in my diary, dude. It was written in my diary, my journal, a long time ago. I already knew this was gonna happen. And now look what's happening. I wrote this stuff so long ago, man. Like, and is it surprising me? No, it's not surprising me at all. I knew in, internally it was gonna happen. Yes, be inspired, my children. I'm inspired now. Thank you, my brothers and sisters. I wanna give my thanks and praises to the universe right now. And the EMTs, the fire departments, the veterans, <laughs> the veterans. We're here, brothers and sisters, and we're here to help you ascend. Because if you, you don't get this knowledge, you're going to really freak out when it happens, okay? For me, would I freak out? No, I wouldn't. Because the things I've already seen, you wouldn't even believe it. I'm telling you a couple things I've seen, and let me tell you, it's unbelievable the things I've seen. It's literally unbelievable. But the thing is, I'm telling the truth. I don't lie about anything I say. I'm not a liar. I don't lie. That's not me. Why the hell would I lie? And I'm not, I'm obviously not out there. I'm here to tell you the truth and hand down the knowledge to you. With that said, brothers and sisters, may peace be with you. Also with you. Life is good. But you better heed my warning on this. Do not freak out when it happens because it's coming.